It's now time to edit your video. This is where having a great script will make your job much easier. Editing is emphasizing your key message by using captions and overlays to show, not tell. First up, to trim your video. Trim off the three second countdown and any pause time at the end of the video so your video begins and ends professionally. Use the voice waveform to identify when you start and stop talking. Playback to ensure you trim in just the right spots. Trimming will ensure your video has a crisp beginning and end and looks professional. There are a number of editing tools in the app that you can use. Number one, you can use overlays, texts, images, videos and footage for your main video. What you can also do is you can split and join and load video segments to create a final video which is a composite of shorter videos. The sky is the limit when it comes to editing overlays and here are our top tips. For text captions, don't cover your face. Move the box if needed. Don't use large blocks of text. Highlight keywords and reiterate spoken words. For images, Video overlays always film in landscape. Please make sure it's not in portrait or else you get those awful black bars on the side. Please make sure you also show, don't tell. This illustrates your point far better. And also time your overlays and captions to use the play line to listen and pause when you want to insert overlays. Avoid maintaining overlays for longer than the topic is discussed. This is the tip of the iceberg when it comes to editing within the app. So don't be scared to explore splitting and joining videos to create your next masterpiece. The next step is to create a thumbnail for your video. This is your cover video and will appear anywhere you share your video. So, be creative with your title, but make sure the viewer knows what to expect. Choose a frame from your video or camera roll for the cover image. Use the thumbnail to entice your audience to click play and contribute to your personal brand. You need to make sure that your image is the right size, your image is centered, your logo is legible and meets your branding guidelines. After editing, it's time to upload your video to the dashboard. You will not be able to make changes to your video once you upload it. You can edit a copy from projects to create a new video. Add a description to your video as well. This will tell viewers what your video is all about. Here, you can use relevant keywords to really increase your video searchability, and this really helps for publicly listed videos. The description appears below the video on YouTube and in Google searches. Always include a clickable call to action link. For job ads, use the apply link. Other CTA links include event registration forms or career pages. Your uploaded video will remain in draft until you publish it. It won't be searchable on the internet as it is a private video. Descriptions and links can be added to the uploaded video from the dashboard at any time. Now it's your turn to record and edit the video. Have fun!